Assalamu alaikum. Uh, it's Friday and uh, the 8th of September. Uh, just want to announce a, a news, uh, especially for pharmacists who actually want to study for this exam, which is called CAPS exam or student pharmacy exam uh, for November and for March or maybe beyond. Uh, I have set up a, a a uh, group where we're giving daily tasks and weekly uh, uh, seminars that we're going to be doing uh, for those who probably don't know anything where to start what to do just uh, no criteria required just need to be a serious pharmacist who want to study and want to progress quickly uh, that name uh, that we call the group is called the boot camp caps boot camp this means that you just enter there and learn uh, from each other and uh, and there will be daily tasks that have been given from the first uh, day and second day and there are a lot of people who were unable to know what to do and they have initiated the process they have established their uh, caps assessment on the portal and now uh, probably they have seen uh, how to start the cap study there's a webinar which we did uh, we, which we share with our uh, students in July we share that and uh, and uh, that will give you a very nice guideline how to start from A to Z in next 60 days or 70 days if you want to pass the exam if for November candidates you can do it no problem uh, it's approximately 70 days left now and good news is that there are lots of seats that can be captured in November dates all over the world especially in Pakistan if you are listening this and the audience who are actually in Dubai, they can also book exam. If you can't fit in in Dubai centers or Abu Dhabi or Middle East, uh, there would be some seats available in Pakistan that you can uh, uh, book your test for November. All right, so I thought I'd just share this news and uh, uh, stay in touch, stay active in the group. Bootcamp group is not just the group that you just enter there and sleep. You make sure you stay active, take participate, show your presence and get your needs, get your value out of it. And um, there are a lot of pharmacists who are progressing very quickly. They were not at all aware about CAPS a week before, and now they are well aware about how, what they will be doing. There were a lot of news we sharing in that, uh, the visa requirements, whatever. It's a mix of, of, for different levels. There are certain people who have already their visas in their hand. Uh, they're about to fly to Australia in that group. You can learn from their experience and uh, you just participate, just make that community a more closer community and a stronger community. All right. Uh, so that will be uh, helpful. I thought maybe uh, leave those uh, criteria because uh, as, as I said in my last video that there were a lot of uh, uh, reasons. Uh, Sometimes a lot of pharmacists were unable to uh, come to that level where they can connect with me. But I just thought maybe just circulate this group openly uh, in three days. There were like 600 or nearly 700 pharmacists filled up that group. Uh, many of them are from Pakistan and many of them from India, Middle East and from Zimbabwe. Uh, so welcome. Uh, and there are some from Nepal, some from Bangladesh uh, and some from Iran as well. And uh, uh, if any uh, any question just write the question there you will get the answer very quickly you can learn about PTE you can learn about how to do uh, uh, you know that uh, assessment for your uh, application uh, don't stuck that you have to have a English translation for your birth certificate you can submit uh, other documents like CNIC or ID card or passport or driving license or even a COVID card or even a domicile so the only three documents are required no attestation required and, um, and start the process of learning. Uh, look, it's just a mental mindset that you have to understand and uh, that you can do it. We have, we have shared the videos of those previous July exam successful candidates where we guided them uh, with a, a similar strategy. You know that daily task is very important and consistency is very important. If you committing two months to change your life it's not a big deal it's not a big deal you can do it because uh, uh, eventually after passing the caps in november or in march obviously you will get a white for your state nomination and you will start working in regional australia all right thanks for listening thanks for it. and share this news to many others that um, you don't have to look for academies notes and this and that uh, it's a very easy process at the moment
with, with, with our group. All right, okay, take care. Thank you. Thank you for listening.